I've literally just loaded up FC25 and EA have already addressed issues for PC and that is the Steam input issue that a lot of people are, have been having recently. If you don't know what that is, essentially it's overlapping your input from two different softwares, two different applications. So as you're playing on EA application, Steam is interfering with your input for your game. So therefore you cannot run, you can't move the controller. You're moving the controller but it disconnects. Like all these issues are quite severe and if if you have not skipped the message that EA have said, I will show it to you right now. For those who have skipped the message about Steam input workaround, this message is from the EA Sports FC team. So here is what you have to do. For the players on Steam who are experiencing control issues when playing with Steam input enabled, please try the following workaround. Disable steam input if it's enabled for ea sports fc25 additionally please disable the ea app overlay by following the steps below open ea app use the same ea account linked to the steam account to log into the ea app click the top left hamburger menu with the three lines it's basically the three lines everywhere you see like in the menus click applications scroll down until you see in-game overlay option make sure the option is unselected Thank you for thanks for your patience and we're working on the future title update to address this issue. So as you can see, EA are already aware about issues that people are having with controllers for PlayStation, for Xbox. So if you have bought the game on Steam and EA app is interfering with said problems, make sure you guys go do this. Yeah, go sort this said problem out. I've seen seeing a lot of people commenting in my videos like, I can't move my controller at all. I can't do this at all. I can't do that with my controller. My players aren't moving in game. Well, this should fix the problem for the majority. If this still doesn't work, then please wait. Be patient, EA. Are literally saying we are working on a future title update to address this issue so ea have actually woken up this year for pc i've never seen a message like this in my entire life on pc the fact is they've realized and they know that there's a lot more players on pc i literally just woke up by the way it's quarter to one in the afternoon and what great news to have honestly so shout out ea for this once again for addressing this issue and addressing this because usually you never you go you go silent and no one is aware of what to do. I'm gonna leave this on screen for you guys to obviously read, do and do so if you guys have bought it from Steam. Once again, if you bought it from EA app, I don't see the problem. If you're having any issues on EA app, then comment them down below because yeah. But if you bought it on Steam, this is what you need to do with controllers. And obviously, 100%. If you have a PlayStation controller. And now and you're just getting so many issues i recommend an xbox controller or a power controller once again and yeah i just i just wanted to give you guys an eye opener to see to show you guys that ea are actively working on pc obviously previous years there hasn't been many signs of this even a simple message like this was not even on the game so the fact that i believe that ea have finally have finally have a dedicated team for pc potentially is just amazing that this is happening and you can see that they actually are slightly caring for the PC guys now. Because they probably have figured out and seen that, oh snap, there's quite a lot of people that actually play this game on PC. Even though it's not the millions, it's uh, a couple hundred thousands. But there's quite a, still quite a lot of fan base and uh, quite a lot of people that play this game on the PC. So that's what they're doing. That's what they're trying to show that, hey, we're working on it. We're going to address it in the later update. Just awesome that a company like this is actually processing and understanding. Hey guys, we've actually messed up. Here's the actual way to fix the problem. And we haven't had this for, what, three years. So shout out to EA for finally flipping caring about PC. And yeah, I just wanted to make this quick video because a lot of people in my comments have been asking about, I can't move my controller. I can't do this. I can't do that. Well, here you go. If you guys have bought it on Steam, here you go. It's been a Borger. Subscribe to keep up to date with all the EFC 25 PC shenanigans. Take care and peace.